Good morning, Garden Friends family. It's Judy from A Girl in the Garden, and today we are just going to um, start some seeds. We are probably like, we're like three weeks out from our last frost date, but so I'm kind of late starting some of the stuff, but typically I don't plant anything until um, Mother's Day weekend. So I still have about a month or so, maybe a little bit over a month and a half um, to Mother's Day. So I'm just gonna start some more peppers. Don't ask, I don't know. I, I swear I'm allergic, or um, I swear I'm addicted to peppers and that's okay. Um, Anyway, with that being said, um, we're gonna start some more flowers, some four to six week flowers. Um, and then I'm just gonna like fill up some trays, get some stuff done. I'll probably be selling some um, seedlings this year. So I just extra to have, um, I'm giving away a lot. So with that being said, let's just go ahead and get started. And um, yeah, I'm just gonna take you along for the ride. Um, what was I gonna say? I don't remember what I was gonna say, but I do know that we have a lot going on. I have 272 trays, I have five, 25, uh, 24 count, and then I have three just solid black that I'm gonna put um, some of these cups in and I can get 18 of those. So 18, 36, 54, roughly. Um, of these so we're gonna be starting like 300 seeds or cells and then obviously like two seeds per cell so anyway that's where we are today so I'm just gonna take you along for the ride
Good morning. I've got a friends and family. It's Judy with the Girl of the Garden, and I'm just going to do a quick walk through my yard just to kind of show you what's going on. Um, earlier in this video, you saw me kind of, uh, well, playing a lot of seeds, but recklessly playing a lot of seeds. Um, I oversowed. I know that I'm about four weeks away from being able to get everything in the garden, but um, I just kind of oversowed because I know I am planning on selling and then I know I have space for all my plants. But I just kind of want to give you a. I don't know. I was out here playing. So I'm just going to show you now that you can see what I did, but I'm going to show you where I did what I did. So one moment. All right. Back here in this corner of my house. Right here, I'm gonna have some um, flowers, probably some like marigolds or something to detour um, my pesky little squirrels. And then I'll bring it around to this side as well, in front of here, probably in pots on this side where this has already been established from last year. Um, in this, I have, what do I have here? Um, I have lilies and ranunculuses. And here I have 200 um, onions. And if you see, the stinking little, oh, animals are starting to dig these up. Okay, so I'm gonna have to come back through here and put another thing of compost on. And um, I'm gonna have to get some marigolds out here, like sooner rather than later along with some Irish spring soap. And here I have my asparagus. I just planted um, six more crowns. I do have some from last year. Um, so those are gonna be second year. And then I have crowns. So hopefully next year I'll be able to um, eat off of some of those from last year. And it looks like I have something big in the hole back there. Do you guys see that? Oh, dang it. And in here, I have, um, I did my potatoes. I did two rows of red in the back and then two rows of purple in the front. And if you see, my garden is fairly low, which I do this for my potato garden bed. Um, so as the potatoes grow, I can, I can stack it higher. All right, over here we have one, two, three, four, um, small raised beds and in here is going to be usually I, I put like uh, herbs and different things in here but um, it didn't work well last year so I'm actually going to do a trellis between these two and a trellis between these two and I'm going to do my cucumbers here I just think that might work a little bit better um, and then I'm trying to like just kill my grass here um, so I could do different things. And then over here, I have my, again, I'm trying to kill some grass. Um, I have green beans, green beans, and peas. So green beans in two of them and peas in that one. Um, and then my son and I came out and we were pulling weeds and there's still some that we have to get if you can see those yeah there's some there's some and then i just need to um get over here and re-rake um and then put compost all down and fill my pots get everything positioned get some marigolds out here get some irish spring and over here if you see this is my trellis um i usually have some sort of green pea or a snap pea or something over in there because um, it keeps cool because I have this big evergreen in my neighbor's yard and then this evergreen in that neighbor's yard. Um, so that's what I have there. And then right here in this raised bed, um, this faces, well, this is on the south fence. And these are all um, snap peas. So they'll trellis up and then um, halfway through the season, I'll plant something else in here. Um, and then I'll just add more soil because it's pretty low but I just wanted to get them in. And this is the south side of the house. This is a hot mess express. We have not touched this. Um, right now it's weeds. It will be tomatoes, peppers, um, and flowers. And I have that down there too but it, this is a hot 
mass disaster, so we're not going to walk through this, but that's my garden space. 